Here's a custom build I worked on. This was the Vassvarn 1911 gel ball blaster. And then I went ahead and put this 3D printed piece on it. Obviously I painted it out. This was one that kind of, I guess, had, you know, a, a multicolor pattern going on it. So I went with this um, nice gray color, I thought. Um, I did find, again, there's always issues with painting these, but these that have graphics seem to do better if you paint them with an enamel. But the problem with this enamel is it just takes a lot longer to dry and you should just really give it a lot of time before you handle it. And, uh, but, but it worked out really well. So painted that with enamel, the 3D printed piece since that's plastic without any color or graphics on it, that was just painted with that gold, um, you know, regular spray paint type, okay? So you may remember that this vast barn is the one where it charges right here. So there's a little plug-in that allows you to just charge right there. And the nice thing with this one is this fit right away. So most of these pieces I'm making with my 3D printer are intended for airsoft guns. And airsoft guns are never, almost never the same dimension. So most of the time I'm doing different things with these uh, different, you know, compensators, muzzles, silencers, where I have to modify them. Um, you know, I have to fabricate some things um, to make them fit. So this did fit though. However, I made it longer because it ended right here and the rail really only starts here. So I wanted to make it encompass the whole rail just to give it more stability because then if you're going to put anything on this rail, you certainly can. So this is on here tight enough that you don't even really need this, but I just went ahead and put one on in the front there. So here gives you a nice look at it to see how that compensator looks. So pretty cool. And of course, still fires nice and turn it safety there. So again, it's the Vassvarn 1911, but a little custom paint job. And then this gold compensator uh, that I went ahead and printed and put on the front there. And this is probably something that will be one of the choices in the gel ball blaster giveaway that will be at the end of March. So stay tuned. I will most likely be including that as one of the options for the winner.